What a good boy. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hi, how's it going? Calvin and I are headed back from base now. We had to stop by Danica's really quick and pick up something for my party tonight. The hostess requested me to demo something specifically and I don't have that right now. I'm gonna have to order it if it's something that people seem to be really interested in. It's a swing, I'll just say that. Anything else, you might have to go and check out the website. My website is in the description below if you're so inclined to know what I'm talking about. It's called The Frequent Flyer. But the hostess was asking if I could demo that tonight. So we had to go and pick that up from Danica so I could borrow that. And then we just went and checked the mail where I got something exciting and I'm so excited! At that octave, I'm exactly that excited. <laughs> But we figured we would bring Zeke along with us. I feel bad when we have to leave him by himself. He's a dog, I know, he doesn't really care. But he cares to me, and he matters to me. We just had to check the mail and get gas while we were on base. So I figured, why not? Because he's not gonna be, you know, in here by himself that long. Though, when we came back out from um, paying inside when we had to get gas. And he was in the front seat. He was in the front seat, yeah. So I probably will have to try to vacuum out the car really quick. Um, when we get home at some point. I still need to finish today's video. I need to pack up the car. I need to vacuum out the car before I do that and pick up the house a little bit. I started dinner in the crock pot this morning because I knew I wasn't gonna be home for when Travis got home to make dinner. So I started dinner in the crock pot, but I don't know what else I'm gonna have made with it. <sighs> I just got the car vacuumed out and I put all of my stock in there as well as putting together the rest of the folders. But today is a little bit scrambled and I'm sorry because party days I always end up scrambling. I feel like I don't have enough hours in the day and I probably slept in a little bit longer than I should have this morning, but I really didn't want to be tired tonight because I knew I was gonna be driving by myself and it's about an hour and a half drive, which isn't an issue, it's not really that far. But when I'm by myself, I don't know how tired I'm gonna get because for some reason, as soon as we get in the car, when it's dark, I start yawning. And I'm not even really that tired, I just start yawning. But I don't even wanna take the chance of being tired tonight because I don't know how long I'm gonna be there, I don't know what time I'm gonna get out of there, and I don't even want there to be the slightest issue of being tired. Real quick, before I get back to editing videos, I'm gonna open this bad boy up. I've been wanting one of these for so long. I didn't get the brand that everyone else gets. I got the one that I wanted. And I'm super duper excited about it. For those of you that follow Got Love, my friend McKenna and her husband Kyle's YouTube channel, you'll have seen them talk about, or heard them talk about, the Instant Pot that they have. It's a pressure cooker and rice cooker and crock pot and it does all these things and it's like a seven in one or something. And I am the queen of forgetting to take meat out of the freezer for dinner. And I like being able to make meals fast. So I got myself one. But it's not the exact same one. This one is called Mealthy, I think. Meal in minutes, it's a multi-pot. It has like a light up LED screen. You can connect to their app. And it does all these great things. But before I talk about it more, I'm gonna pull it out of the box. It comes with a rice paddle and soup ladle, measuring cup, a spare gasket, oven mitts, condensation catcher, steam rack, steamer basket, obviously the cord. Also some um, recipe books, quick start guides, cheat sheets, which would be all of that. It's a perfect fit for you. I actually really love oven mitts like this. We have this dinosaur, crocodile, whatever it is, frog, I don't know. And I love it. And I've looked for more, but I've never been able to find any. And this came with two. Nice. This is pretty cool. I don't really know how to use it yet because I've obviously never used it before, but I'm really excited to find out. I kind of want to plug it in just to see. I forgot I got a 110 bolt and I'm going to have to use an adapter for it. Totally forgot, so I'm not even going to mess with that right now. I might 
make dinner with it tomorrow or something. Now I have to edit. Enjoy your box. I'm editing today's video and this guy had his head on this side of the door. Oh, sweet baby. Mama. Yes. You want to see what track I made? Okay, let's go look. Let's see what he did. Okay. You're making a mess. Nice track, dude. But I, I need a little more tracks. To... Yeah, maybe next time we go to Ikea, we can get you a couple more packs. Yeah. Yeah, then you could have a track built around this whole house. Yeah. That'd be crazy. Around the couch, back right there. Maybe even under the couch. Oh, baby dog. Hi, baby. I love you. You're doing good. There's a couple more pieces by the door. <gasps> For whatever reason, it seems like my nails take forever to dry. And the only place I'm sitting still enough and not touching things is when I'm editing videos. So I just had to touch up my nails because they chip so easy. Because they bend, they'll start breaking right where they, see that? Yeah. It's usually where they break off and then it starts chipping because my nails bend so easy. So. I painted them and I actually need to put the last clear coat on and then finish this video because it's already almost two o'clock. This video needs posted in like an hour and then I need to leave like right after that. About an hour ago, the hostess of my party tonight asked if I could push it back a little bit. So instead of it starting at 5.30, it is now starting at seven, which means I have a little bit more time at home. So I'm actually uh, re-dyeing my hair more red while waiting, but I also just took out the garbage and I'm gonna get myself something to eat here shortly. In the meantime, I'm doing laundry. And I also need to um, organize all of this because now that I have all of this storage space, I need to figure out the best way to utilize it. I know I need to get more baskets and stuff like that, but until then, I need to figure out a better um, organization thing going on here. It would snow the day I need to drive an hour and a half at night time. Of course it would snow. I'm big grandma driving the entire way. You better believe it. Travis just texted me and said that I could take Calvin to his work if I needed to because it's already five o'clock and Travis gets off at 545. But Calvin was pretty persistent that he wanted to go to Damaris's because he's been excited about getting to go to Damaris's and play with Hezekiah all day. So, we're heading out I to the Maris's. I just want to see if they have Uno attack. That's all you wanted? Yeah. Oh, great. Of course my battery's dying and I forgot the other one. Of course it is! Great! This is exactly what I was hoping would not happen on my way up here. We've literally been doing between 40 and 60 the entire way on the Autobahn because the road is like a solid sheet of ice, slush, or snow in certain areas. Yeah. And most traffic is driving in just one lane, as you can tell, because like the slow lane right now is white and there's more traction over here. Oh my gosh, I've been shaking driving for like the last hour. I'm so nervous. I'm trying to be so careful. I don't like this trying not to be this guy right now. Really trying. Update, not any better. Also, there's a truck stocked up here on the side of the road and I've already passed them once. Let me explain that in a little bit. Well, if that doesn't look crazy, holy snopes, why am I still driving? So here's my current situation. My camera's almost dead, but I couldn't not update you guys. Um, I'm sitting out front of the Spangdalem shop at right now because my party was up here. 
Look at all the snow. So here's what happened. We're home now. Travis came to rescue us. Well, rescue me. Calvin and Travis came to rescue me. <laughs> Go potty. It started snowing today at like two or something. And I thought, it'll stop. It'll stop snowing. It always just stops snowing. It's not gonna snow that much, it'll be fine. So I kept driving. I drove up to Spangdalem. Well, I was about 15 minutes from the hostess's house. And she's like, hey, everyone except two people canceled, her being one of them. So only one other person was gonna show up. And I was like 15 to 20 minutes away. So I turned around. This one stretch of the Autobahn, there was only an exit like a couple miles apart. And it was like up this really kind of steep hill, long steep hill. So I passed that truck once and then like went up and that was where I had turned around and came back down the hill. And I had called Travis and he said to go back to Spangdalem because we were just gonna leave my car up there and he was gonna come and rescue me because his car is much more suitable for the winter time right now. <laughs> so he didn't want me driving all the way back home. He felt better about just coming to get me, so I left my car on Spangdalem, and him and Calvin came and rescued me. But by the time we were driving back, the roads were a little bit better, but still not quite to what I wanted to drive home in, so. So now it's uh, after 11. Travis was up at four and needs to be up at four again in the morning. And this is our current situation. <laughs> oh, this is the first time Travis has been home since this morning. He didn't even stop by the house earlier. And he hasn't even had dinner. Dinner's done. In the crock pot. We got Calvin some pizza. Oh, Zeke, this smells good. I'm surprised you didn't eat it. Look at all the snow. You should go run into snow. Do you want to? Do you want to? Let's go. Get him, Ziggy. Get him, Ziggy. Get him, Ziggy. Get him, Ziggy. You're so crazy. Give me that toy. I'm going to throw it out in the snow. <laughs> Ziggy! No! Do you want me to do it again? Oh, I hit the tree. <laughs> he picks it up and shakes it. You're so cute. <laughs> he fast feet runs in here like his feet are cold. Boo. What are you doing here? Hey, I love you.